Good evening, everybody. Welcome back to this next exciting match here between South Africa and Peru. We've got game six, round five in the group B in this XTC tournament coming for you live from my channel. I'm Arnie, I'm your host, and I will be guiding you through this game tonight. Welcome once again for joining me and hope you guys have fun watching this game tonight. We are a little bit slightly ahead of schedule, but entertainment never sleeps. So I would say let's get this ball rolling, guys. So let's quickly go through the guys lists. We've got Brandon Carter on the left hand side playing for South Africa. He's playing the first order. We've got a major Von Rigg in the Thai BA Interceptor with Daredevil. One rig you don't, you don't know during system phase, which is one enemy ship in your bullseye arc, and then you can get a deplete or strain token of your choice, and then you can do an action from there. Uh, Kylo Ren in a Thai, intercept, a Thai Silencer with extreme maneuvers, can boost action with force, and um, Rush and also a Thai Silencer with no modification. So Rush becomes um, initiative 6 when he is damaged. Then on Peru's side for an Arturo, he is playing the Galactic Republic. We have three Jedi Knights. Change the colors quickly. Uh, three Jedi Knights all with Delta 7B. So they lose agility down to two agility. And they go up to shields 3. So um, that is the the drawback. You lose agility, but you get shields. And then he's got another uh, ether sprite. So all of them are ether sprites. And on that other ether sprite, he's got Luminara, is the the pilot in the ether sprite. And uh, her ability is while the finish up range zero to two defends. If it's not in the attacker's bullseye arc, you must spend a force. And if you do change one res crit result to a hit result, or one hit result to a force uh, a focus result, so that's pretty interesting. And she's got the new style chopper. I would say a new style chopper. I haven't seen this uh, uh, pointed out like this before. Uh, looks like the guys are basically almost ready to go. And there is the second ping. So I'll. So yeah, they should be ready to go in a few seconds. Let's see what they do. And they have started the timer a few seconds ahead of my schedule. <laughs> uh, but who's counting? Who's counting? All right, guys. Yeah, just to finish up the the list there. Um, he has okay, there's a green, red, and a blue uh, ether sprite. So the Minara also ether sprite. He has the new style chopper. I call it the new style chopper does a lot of shenanigans as i would say uh of the executor maneuver you may spend a charge and you can perform red action even while stressed and you flip the active charge at the end of the end phase during the end phase and then it has a red on the other side of the card as well which can give you another ability to choose a ship range zero to one and gains a jam so yeah Let's see what happens in this game. So, the guys are already flying. One hell of a shot here. Looks like we got five straights from all the Delta 7s. The Jedi Knights. And Luminara as well, five straight with a boost forward. <laughs> That's interesting. His force tokens is baby Yoda faces. That is very interesting to see. <laughs> Look at that. Nice. <laughs> I like it. Well done, Peru. <laughs> they look pretty cool. Uh, let's also just uh, show off here as well a few additions made as well. Um, the Peru colors are all over the ships. Red and white. That actually looks pretty cool. Zooming quickly, that should be Peru colors there, yeah. And as well as we've got 
on the South African ships we got the flags. So for those who want to see it there, that looks pretty cool. And we've got some alt art cards here. That looks pretty cool. All of these guys going full out with modif uh, with with uh, nice cosmetic modifications on their ships, as well as all the other games I've seen so far. And these guys are doing very, 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 very. Oh, how can I say? Uh, uh, altercations to make the game more interesting. So yeah, that's pretty cool, guys. We've seen. Silencer von Rick, uh, Intercity von Rick doing the three straight and doing a. That's it. <laughs> and then, uh, what's his name? Is this the other guy's going one left turn from Kylo? And then Rush, where's Rush? Why is Rush in blue? I don't know. Oh, Rush to the bank too. That's pretty cool. So, next round of this activation. Rue went five straight with all the all these ships. And one boosted forward. Target locking all on this rock over here. So yeah. Welcome everybody to my stream. We're gonna have some fun tonight. Rush going a three straight forward. If I can see correctly, yeah, three straight forward. As well as a focus. Ooh, another five straight with a boost. Arturo is aggressive. Aggressiveness can be good and it can be bad at the same time. Spending his uh, forces to do those boosts. Let me just look at these cards quickly. After you fully execute the move, you the force to do a boost. Yeah, that's great. And then he does an action. Luminara. They are. A lot of games happening tonight as well, guys. I think there's currently a game on between Scotland and Iceland as well. It's half an hour earlier to ours. There's a game between Spain and Chile. Same time as ours. And I think there's still a game tonight between New Zealand and Germany. Uh, just after this game, basically. So, uh, a lot of entertainment still coming. In an early, early morning, there's... A lot of games happening early morning. They are. Watch them, guys. Watch them support. Okay, so Kylo did a one hard to the right. And he is target locking a different rock. Because he wants to target lock that different rock. <laughs> he doesn't want to, but he has to. That's what he's getting. Right. Major Von Rigg going five straight, four straight forward. Going past that rock. Probably going to boost in. Alrein. Yeah, the fine tune thrusters is you get a, a strain or deplete to do a either dog lock or barrel action. Right, so these 
Jedi Knights came up very quickly down the top side of that board. Seems like Luminara used one of his chopper surges, so I need to take that off. Up, up. Yeah, he was an interesting droid. He's an interesting droid. He's pretty cool. Yeah. So guys, I think there's two rounds left after this round in all the groups for the XTC tournament. The seven rounds in total. So uh, I think there's still two rounds to go after this. A lot of X Wing still happening, guys. Fortunately, there has to be teams that that can't make it to all the way to the top. But that's part of a competition, guys. It is winners and losers. Winners, losers, runner-ups, almost theirs, just not made it. A lot of different ways to put it. <laughs> yes, I'm talking smack. <laughs> right, three banks in from the Jedi Knights. Sorry, uh, Rush did a two, uh, one bank, uh, one heart around the rock. We've got the Jedi Knights coming in three bank. Also very aggressive once again. Spending the force again to do a boost. Ooh. Ooh. They want, they, 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 uh, they want blood. They want blood. And I think their sights is on Kylo. I think their sights is on Kylo, it looks like it. They are, with this turn, they're coming in one by one. Ah, it's not that one, no, one by one. Remember once, the, the, the last time I flew like this in a line, my ships just got blew up one by one as they started to get shot at. It wasn't very fun. Hey, but the mistake I made, I paid for it. <laughs> I paid for badly. Right, so Luminara moved in a bit, so I can move in a bit as well. Ta-da! <laughs> Doesn't the sword? I move the camera. Oh, sorry, and I didn't introduce my fellow co-host, who's always here. Pikachu, for guys who don't know, he's lurking behind you, and uh, yeah, he sometimes scares me, but he's a good guy, hasn't shocked me yet. So Kylo decides to go a five straight. Trying to just get out of most of all the orcs where humanly possible. Um, yo. I really don't think Brandon wants to sh split up his ships right now. But I think good option for him potentially to get away from some of the orcs is to maybe barrel up and boost left. That could be the option. Or, he can just maybe stay there and take a, take a focus. We all know the silences does not have evade tokens. They are not full on defenders. Yeah, I said it. Arturo, uh, Arturo, I must pronounce this correctly, guys. Um, 
Oh wait, hang on. <laughs> Look at that. I've got initiative triggers for both these guys. I do apologize. Brandon had the initiative as far as I could see. But uh, because of the pilot skills at this point in time, I don't think it really matters. Rush is pilot skill 2 until he gets hit. Uh, then we've got Kylo, pilot skill 5. Bonrek, pilot skill 6. All the Jedi Knights are pilot skill 3s. And Luminara, pilot skill 4. So there's no overlaps per se. Kylo decides to take a target lock by the looks of it. Um, he is taking the route of potential the dice is going to have to help me here but he does have force so he does have a bit of modifications and he is doing a extreme maneuvers boost interesting so he obviously wants a bit of guns on as well force straight from von rig and he is taking a train to do a barrel snow. Eh, I call it a barrel snow. Extreme maneuvers boost. Uh, daredevil boost, which is red. He is taking that route. So it looks like there is going to be some fire from both these guys, potentially. One rig might just be. Ah, uh, okay. So just maybe from Kylo. Just out. Well, almost, almost, Brandon, almost. Next time we'll do it. But, first fire of the game, guys. First engagement of the game engagement. Kylo Ren will be shooting at Jedi Knight 3. Three dice, Kylo Ren. Let the dice roll. Doot, 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 doot. There was a small bit of lag. I do apologize for that. Don't know why. Always happens. So, two hits and a blank there from Kylo into Jedi Knight Green. He re rolls with the target lock into a focus. Is he going to spend his force to change that? Does he want maximum damage? He is going for maximum damage. Three hits into Jedi Knight Green. And Jedi Knight Green spends his force after he got a focus into blanks. Change that. So he loses two shields. Jedi Knight Green is off there, no force, uh, there's also no force in Jedi Knight Red, as well as Jedi Knight Blue, no forces, and there's one force left on Luminara. Cool, awesome, okay, cool, so, looks like Blue is shooting at Kylo, so Arturo shooting at Kylo Ren, of all Blue shooting at Kylo Ren, so he's chasing that Okay, so he had that. He's changing the focus to a hit. With his focus. And there is one evade and... Oops. Sorry. Three blanks from Kylo. Next round of firing is a hit and two blanks. And there is a evade and two blanks from Kylo. So, that didn't hit Kylo at all the second round, time round. But he did take a shield in the first engagement. It looks like there was some blood drawn, guys. There was definitely some blood drawn. Alright, so guys must just remember to... charge all the force. The Arturo's got it, he's got all his force recharged. Ooh, guys making decisions, decisions, decisions. Welcome to everyone who joined. Thank you for watching in this next exciting game between South Africa and Peru. XTC Tournament 2021.
Yeah, I think there is a force by Kylo still bending. I must just remember to put that force back. That unfortunately is up to the players to to keep the board state ready. Ah, there we go. Force is back. Woohoo! They finally saw it. <laughs> So, decisions being made here by both these guys. You, Brandon, has basically kind of finalized his dials. The moment when it comes to damage wise, um, Brandon is leading two damage on one of the Jedi Knights, and there's one damage on Kylo, but that is not points, guys, it's just damage. One or two dials to lift. Oh, no, no, lift dials are good. All right, Rush comes in with a one hard with the focus. He wants to potentially see if he can reap a little bit of a benefit of the gas cloud. One Jedi Knight coming in, just focusing. He's keeping the force. Two bank in from the other Jedi Knight, blue. He's also probably maybe just going to focus, or he might target lock, or something else. <laughs> I know what I would do. Once again, welcome, welcome viewers. Thank you for joining. We had a one bank from Jedi Knight 3, which is green. And Luminara he came through with a two bank as well. Kylo decides to turn away. With a two bank right. And a stream maneuvers boost. That? Bunch of on ring bank turn. What is this? Oh, banked right. <laughs> this is a very interesting play here from Bannon. Bringing himself around that rock to try and intercept. And flank the this ether sprites from the rear. That is pretty cool. So he took a strain to barrel, and he's doing a daredevil boost. 
this. Um, I think it must just... Because that was definitely a, a, a extreme maneuvers boost. He's supposed to flip his... Horse, if not mistaken. Yeah, so we've got a range three shot. Not through a rock. From Von Reg onto Luminara. Hit focus and a blank. Oops, sorry, wrong side. Sorry, wrong side. Hit focus and a blank. And there is two evades of focus and a blank from Luminara. Nothing happening there. Okay, so Kyler rolls. He takes a hit and two focuses. Uh, no, sorry, a crit and two focuses. He spins a target lock, rerolling both the blank uh, blow focuses. Um, I think. Hang on. Um, am I correct in saying that he did a? Wasn't that the extreme maneuvers boost, guys? So you shouldn't have that force. Um, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, guys, uh, yeah, sorry, there was a shot as well now from Did I knight day three hits? On to Rush Rush did a focus and three Focus and three blanks. So rush is two shields down plus a hit. Um, ah, come on. Okay, looks like they missed the trigger, I think. Okay, so red Jedi shooting into rush, a hit into blanks, rush defends, two evades and a focus. Um, I called a captain. Okay, so I don't think it will make that big massive difference. Okay, cool, right. Get my bearings, Arnie. <laughs> Get my bearings. Luminara wasn't hit, so I don't think it would have been that big massive situation. As long as they're happy with it. So the next dolls is on their way. Let's just look at that as an honest mistake. I did call a captain. Not available. But I don't think it would have changed the board state that much.
Guys getting run ready for the next round. Rush took some damage there. I think Rush might be might be half points now. I think so, yes. Yeah. So Peru moves up points wise 29 to 0 for South Africa. Okay, give me one second. Do, 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 do. Right, give me a second. Sorry guys, I'm just uh, clearing something up with one of the captains quickly. Hey okay guys, yes, so there was a, a trigger state that didn't impact the game that much. So I think, okay, and Captain cleared it, so we're all good to go. Don't have to worry about it. Game on! Well, game's still on. <laughs> guys, awesome. Awesome. Both captains are in agreement. Woohoo! Yay! <laughs> Did my job. Awesome. Right, guys. Sorry, to get back to the action. We've got 44 minutes left to go in this game. Uh, the timer might be a few seconds uh, too quick. But uh, points on the board for Peru. 29 points to 0 for South Africa. And... Um, Everything is good to go and everyone is ready. And now we just wait for the next round of engagements. Oh so yeah. Brandon was doing quite well there to, to evade most of all the shots. That need that was potentially going to go to Von Rig and Silencer, but Rush took a, a little bit of a beating, but he's still okay. He's not he's not down yet. All these Jedi Knights are turning around. They've got beef, and then Jedi Knight Green is just turning to left. Both the other two did signal loops. And they want Rush. But Rush has got beef as well. He is now in East of Six. So he is going to shoot first before these Jedi shoot. Which is a little bit of upper hand for him. But the Jedi's are not lying down. 
they are in it for the long haul. Arturo doing very good putting pressure on to Brandon. The Peru putting a lot of pressure on to South Africa here. To fly to fly good and not get shot at too much and vice versa. Toro is also very doing very good not to get shot at that much. So both guys under a little bit of pressure as uh, as our old Queen friend will say it under pressure. <laughs> Let's see what we got. Alright, let me just adjust a few things here. Looks like uh, music might have been a bit bright, but not that hard. Cool, so two bank left from Kylo into a boost. First taking a target target lock on we did take a toggle lock. Did we take a toggle lock? No, we didn't take a toggle lock. We just boosted. Didn't see a toggle lock. Von Rig did a one turn hard to the left and he distressed. And he is right in the face there of Jedi Knight Blue and Green. Didn't bump, so he still has choosing time. Right, so we've got our first shooting of this engagement. Uh, Rush is shooting at green Jedi Knight, crit hit focus. Uh, Rush did a bump, so you can't change that. Cool, so Artura needs to roll. Two focuses. Does he have a focus to spend? Yes, he does. Is he going to spend it? He surely is. Therefore, two hits onto two evades. No damage. Cool. So we've got Von Rig shooting range one into green as well with a hit hit and a focus. He does have a focus token to spin, but he's going to get fire back, so I don't know if he would like to spend it. Von Rick does have three defense dice, so he should be okay. Looks like he's spending his target lock, re-rolling, into a blank. So unfortunate, same type of result. And we've got a evade and a blank from green taking another shield. I think that is half points on green. Indeed it is. Then Kylo shooting a range two onto Luminara. Hit focus and blank. Is he going to change anything? Whoops. <laughs> there goes the dice. <laughs> that dice went all the way to the side of the map. Let's check. Is he going to change it? He is taking a target lock off. He's just running one, getting the same result, and then spinning the force to take two hits. And Luminara basically almost natties out. That last dice just decided to roll to an eye, but it's just enough for him to evade the shot from Kylo. There's a range one shot into Rush. From Luminara. Hit a crit and a blank. And Rush takes a crit. One evade for Rush. Two blanks. Rush takes a crit. We've got a direct hit on Rush. Oops, wrong guy. So Rush takes a direct hit and takes one more hit there. So he's on one half. One hull. Health. Same type of thing. 
<laughs> in this game, Hull is life. Right, so. Uh, what's the name of this? Uh, Blue is shooting at Rush. Hit, hit, and focus. And Rush takes another hit. Just one that crept through. Oops, sorry. It was a blank there. And that is the end of Rush. With Blue shooting and getting that last hit through on Rush. That is Rush down. Green shooting range 1 at Von Reg. 4 dice in Bullseye. That is a hit, hit, eye and a blank. And Von Reg says no because he gets 2 focuses and a blank and he changes that with his focus token. Right. So no damage there from these two guys. But unfortunately we lost one ship. In this matchup, there are only six ships remain on the board. We've lost Rush, two ships on the side of South Africa, four ships on the side of Peru. Rush is down. That actually brings the points up for Peru a bit more. Peru sitting on 57 points over 25 for South Africa, half pointing that one green Jedi. And with 35 minutes to go and some change, still stuff that can happen. Right. Once again, thank you for everyone who tuned in, who is still tuned in, who's tuned in just now, and who is going to tune in still. They hear me somehow. <laughs> Welcome to my channel once again. Bring you this game. XTC tournament between South Africa and Peru. Group B, round 5, game 6. There's still one more game for these two guys, two teams to face off on tomorrow. I think that is tomorrow, yes. Let's see. Yeah, that is tomorrow afternoon at 1400 UTC. Will be the last game for these two teams in this round. Right. So these guys are deciding what needs to happen. Oh, coffee's almost done, guys. I need more coffee. I need to check up on something quickly here. Yeah? Was posted. Right. Something bugging me in my eye the whole evening. It should go away soon. <laughs> yeah. These guys getting ready for the next round. For activations. Could you just say nothing as usual? Just checking on him. Very quiet. Right. Okay, so 32 minutes left. These guys are deciding and finalizing what's happening. So there's a system phase trigger there from Von Rig. 
having a bullseye on blue Jedi, giving him a deplete. Got less pew pew in his arsenal. So a two sloop there from Green Jedi. He is deciding he wants to live a bit longer. Okay, so... Give me a second. Okay, sorry, I missed you completely. There's a one bank from Red Jedi. <laughs> okay, um, there's been a <laughs> request on the, the chat stream. Arriba Peru! <laughs> and you got it, mate. You got it. <laughs> so, get back to the action again. Um... One bank was done by red, and then Luminara came in with a two hard left. Kylo's doing a three straight, taking a target lock. He is taking target lock on Luminara. It's Luminara, yeah, Luminara. And boosting in with the extreme maneuvers. Able. If we get a shot on, and a Von Rig joining the fight there, moving in with a one bank, right up in the face of Luminara there. He is taking a deplete, take a target lock, and he is taking a focus as his normal action. Right, so let's see what happens in this one. He's got a range 2 shot. With that deplete, he's only got 2 dice he's rolling. Two dice from Von Reg. Natty's out, 2 hits. We've got Two evades and a blank from Luminara. Kalorin also needs to shoot. Also shooting at Luminara. He's got a hit focus and a blank. What was it? Focus, focus, blank. Did I? Oh, Luminara told him to change that. Yes, so he used his target lock. And he got two hits and a focus. And Luminara only has one evade. Therefore, taking one hit. So Luminara is shields down. Right, so Luminara is going to retaliate. Shooting back at Von Reg, Range 2. Okay, two dice. Hit and a focus. She is spending her focus token. And the blank out from one rig taking two hits. One rig taking two shields down, and that brings one rig also half points, if not mistaken. Alright, green knight. On top, rolls three focuses, and he spends his one force to change that to a hit. And we've got to evade black and focus from one rig in that engagement. Range three into Kylo. Nadie's out. 
Wow. Kylo. Two evades and two blanks. Kylo takes another shield. Kylo's down shield as well. So both both first order guys, pilots has got no shields. And Luminara and Green Jedi Knight also got no shields. And uh yeah, that's happening. Anytime, guys. For that shout out, it was pretty cool. Right, guys, getting back onto the next thing. Not a problem, Renato. Not a problem. I will stream as much as possible games as I can for the fans. Here's <laughs> my last sip of coffee. Right. Thank you for everyone that's watching. We've got 25 minutes left in this game. Peru stacked up a little bit more points there by getting half points on one rig. So Peru is leading 86 points to 25 over South Africa. So yeah, 25 minutes with some chains left to go. Never get enough of this music. Pretty cool. Do, 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 do. So guys, oh sorry, I think there was someone who asked who is playing tomorrow. Um, it was the link. I think that is uh, Pierre and Sebastian playing tomorrow. The last game in this round for South Africa and Brew. Double check that. Yeah, that will be streamed by. Rosangela Scrodden is that is Peru themselves streaming the game. Yay! I'm gonna watch that. Need a co commentator? I'll be available. So these guys are getting ready for next in, 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 let me start again guys get ready for the next activation phase right to sloop from a red jedi knight moving into a position to intercept potentially kylo and von rig Blue doing a one bank. No, blue doing a two. One turn, sorry, one turn. Is there two? I don't know. And then a one bank right from green. Coming back into this fight. I think uh, Arturo is going for a block here with blue. All depends now which side. Uh, Major Von Rig is going, as well as potentially 
making a bit of havoc there for Silencer as well. So, well positioned there from Peru. Decent amount of guns on if need be. Credit to Mr. Michael Wells for sponsoring the, the stream music. Thank you very much. Kylo moving in to bank to the left. He's just taking a focus and boosting around. That is just not enough to take him out of the arc of blue, but it will take him potentially out of range one and out of the option that Mon Monrig would have potentially bumped. I am mumbling, buttering. <laughs> it's life. Ah, no, 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 no. Right, so Von Rig is shooting at red. It's a hit and a focus. Spins his target lock and still keeps his, he has that focus, so no change there. Yellow Knight responds with a natty roll, two evades. Only has two dice to roll because of the Delta 7. Die silencer, Mr. Kylo Ren, decides to shoot at range 2 into green Jedi. Hit, focus, and a blank. Right, he's changing that focus to a hit with his force. And that is two hits on green. Makes more contact than he would have wanted green. Or more damage into green. He's green with one hole left. That is then green shooting back at Kylo. He's got beef. One hit and two blanks. And Kylo decides to say, sorry, not now. I want to still fly around a bit. I'll evade that one. Now blue. Blue is going to go one reg range one in bullseye. Which means he gets extra dice there. He... Crit, hit, hit, and a blank, uh, a, a focus. He spends his focus into a hit. That's four hits. Can Von Rig negate that? No, Von Rig does take three hits and a crit. Crit is Fulik. Two hits and a crit, Fulik. Oh. Here's a... Shot and a half there from Peru. Well shot. So red shooting at Kylo. Hit hit and a blank. And Kylo decides to evade both of them. So Kylo still says a little bit later. I still want to fly around. 
So unfortunately for Von Rig, also good shot down. But that's how the dice rolls, guys. That's the that's the results we get. That is how the game is played. Points now shifting more into Peru's favor with Von Rig off the field as well with Rush. 16 minutes left with some change in this game. Arturo from Peru is leading 114 points to 25. And yeah, Brandon from South Africa, 25 points. Only getting half so far on Green Jedi Knight. Other two Jedi's are still, still within a fair amount of hull and shields. Kylo with four hull left is going to make or break here in this next few minutes. What's left of this game? 16 minutes left now, guys, officially. Let's see what happens here, guys. Can Kylo pull it back? Is there enough time? Is there enough patience? I have to wait and see. Right, so last bit of dials being set by Peru. Last minute change. Oh, well, I think he accidentally pressed undo there. You're reaching a little bit, yeah. So, yeah. Accidentally pressed undo there, so you moved backwards. Right, so Peru moving. Two sloop with blue Jedi Knight. Taking a stress. One bank in with a red Jedi Knight. Taking away that stress. Oops, I must actually still... I think I did not update these Jedi Knights' forces. I do apologize, guys. They all still have force, and I'm sitting here... Fire on my face. <laughs> with no force updates. So, a target lock from Jedi Knight 3 green onto von rig uh, onto, onto, onto kylo sorry von rig is gone luminara turning in one hard left anticipating the flyby from kylo potentially he's within range one so he's giving kylo a jam so whatever target lock or Circle token Kylo is doing, he's going to lose. Oh wow. That is a good ability from Luminara. Oh, sorry, that's a C3PO ability. Yuck. And that's the last charge of uh, C3PO. Sorry, C110P, Mr. Chopper. Five straight from Kylo Ren with a barrel out. That puts him in potentially only yeah, that's only one fire potential from from the knights. The red has got a range three shot on Kylo. Kylo with one force. It hit in a blank. I think he is going to spend his target lock. Yes, he is. Rerolling that. Blank into a hit. Kylo. Evade, focus, and two blanks. He spends his one 
uh, forced to change that to an evade but still taking one hit that is also bringing kylo on half points as well Peru scraping up those points slowly but surely leading once more a little bit further ahead 154 over 25 12 minutes left and uh let's see if kylo can remedy a bit more here Peru is doing very well scrap uh, getting those points together all done on both teams flying decently to get those arcs on and get those damage through Once again, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate the support. Uh, still more games to come that will be streamed. I try and pick up a bit more games from, from other countries as well as I can. Time difference is making it a bit difficult though with work and everything and stuff like that. But I'll make a plan. I'll make a plan. So, a... 5k turn from Jedi Knight Green. He means business. Well, not necessarily business necessarily because that K turn puts him far out of arc and range. Red moving four straight. Using his force to barrel out. And then taking a focus. So he's got one force less now. That is red. Blue coming in three straight. Loses his stress. And as far as I know they had. Kylo in range takes a toggle lock. And one bank to the right from Luminara. Question is, is Kylo going to choose violence or is he going to make up a bit of time? Kylo is not choosing violence per se, but he is turning into into the Jedi Knight and the Minara. What he is going to do from here is a different question. So, ball position there from Peru, casting a, a wide enough net to catch Kylo in that net. And Kylo is just going to make some distance up so he doesn't get. A lot of shots range one in the face wall flown there range three from luminara into kylo three die three dice oh no two dice sorry two dice yeah but she doesn't have the title three dice defense from kylo hit and a focus spins the focus to turn kylo who evades a focus and a black. So Kylo says, nope. Let's try next time. Well shot there by Luminara. Getting the two hits in. Both dice. And Natty's out with red Jedi Knight. Only one evade there from Kylo. Kylo takes two more hits. That's Kylo down to one hull, everybody. Kylo's down to one hole. He recharged his force. But both forces now. This game has turned very much into Peru's favor. Ball flown Peru. Ball flown South Africa. Seven minutes to go.
7 minutes left and some change. Score is currently still 154 to 25. Peru, Peru leading this match. But let's see. Does Kylo have a little bit of more breath inside him? Hope he does. are set on Peru's side. I think it might be a very obvious turn for Peru to turn in and try and see if they can get guns on on Kylo. Oh. Nine minutes of this game, guys. We will be joining these two players after the game is done. We have a quick um, after battle report with them for a few minutes. Get the viewpoint of uh, how the game went. And uh, we will chat with them after live on stream just after this. So a two sloop from Red Jedi. One hard turn left from blue I think he might be barreling to get away from that gas cloud by using the force to barrel and taking a standard focus I think he has a potential maybe boost yes are we looking at a boost no we're looking at a barrel roll so force barrel roll from green and taking a focus green is the only ship on Peru's side that ta has taken major damage one shield down Luminara both blue and red is <laughs> is still full health one health left on Kylo Kylo still has both force tokens, but he has a bit of modifications. Now, interesting for Luminara doing a boost there, force boost. And jamming. On. Cool. So it's a must jam. Kylo decided to do one hard in left. Luminara caused the bump. And... That is, unfortunately, the maneuver, the maneuver there. So nothing else that Kylo can do other than to try and shoot. So he's taking a... The only shot he has, a range 3 shot through a gas cloud onto Blue Knight. Crit, crit. Oops, sorry. Crit, crit, and a blank. And the knight says focus and three blanks. Gas cloud and a focus. He turns around. Says I will evade that for now, good sir. Range three back into Kylo. From blue Jedi Knight. Whoa, Natty's out. Crit. Hit, hit. And Kylo... Blanks are completely as well. Yeah, he should have rolled five dice. Yes. Uh, and he gets two evades and still three hits. It's not enough. Kylo does take the crit. 
if not mistaken that is the crit and that is kylo what will be the crit be mr good sir we'd like to see <laughs> Okay, so it looks like he's not putting the crit down. Yeah, that is the last shot on Kylo, guys. That is the game. That is the game. So, a full 200 points to Peru for destroying all the ships. And 25 points for South Africa. Well done to Peru for this... For this... Win. And well done to both these guys for this match. Good match... Some good flying, some good arc dodging, and dice was good all around, but there was a few dice that wasn't that good. But that's part of dice rolling, guys. It could be good or it can be bad. But yeah, um, I see they're discussing a few things there, but that is game. So let me pop in quickly there and just chat with him quickly and get the view of the game. So let me just move her, guys. Position with the fine tools. Yeah. How's it, guys? Hello. How's it, how's it? Hello. How are you guys doing? Good, good, good. We're finished. Good, good. Cool. Just uh, popping in quickly and saying uh, well done on the game, guys. I'm good flying. Um, you. Anything you guys would like to say after this game? Uh, yeah, we 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 had a good chat already. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. So I just missed it. Ah, damn. So, oh. for, oh. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, yeah, anything you guys would like to to, to add? To anything for the viewers? Thank you for uh, watching. Maybe yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Therefore, whoever, whoever did watch, uh, I hope it was enjoyable watching the first order get to get taken out totally. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, uh, yeah bad likes on the day. Yeah, Arturo flew really well, and yeah, yeah, my dice was super, super cold. Yeah, I know the dice. <laughs> there were some good ones. There were some bad ones. Yeah, but uh, I, yeah, yeah, it, it was, seemed it was, the, the 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 red dice for Arturo was red hot, and my my green dice was red. It was was ice cold. Cold. Yeah. <laughs> we should we should next time try and see if we can change the evade dice to blue. Yeah. So it'll be oh. even more colder. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Yeah. But yeah, guys, thank you very much for the opportunity to stream the game. It was pretty cool. Yeah, no. Cool. Uh, thank you. Cool, cool. Yeah, so thanks, let me thanks, thanks. let me quickly do a sign off quickly, and then uh, we'll cool. take it from there. Sure. So awesome. guys, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. It was a very interesting game. Uh, well done on Peru for the win. Well done thank on you. both these pilots. For, for inciting game and yeah guys thank you very much for watching uh subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet uh like the video if you like the happening and uh comment below whatever you would like to and uh yeah thanks guys see you cool. then next time thanks players for the game it was pretty cool once again yeah. thanks and, thanks everybody uh, Go, go, go. And uh, that is me signing off. So see you guys tomorrow for the next game between Pierre and Sebastian. Will be streamed live on uh, what is yeah Rosangela Squadron. Yeah, I can never pronounce that word properly. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, Sorry, yes, guys. <laughs> yeah. Um, so see you guys tomorrow. I will be uh, co-hosting there as well with uh, with I think it's this yeah. Uh, co-hosting so yeah guys thank you very much for watching and see you tomorrow